At Dana-Farber, we've been treating our um, adolescents and young adults uh, according to a pediatric-inspired regimen uh, developed by um, our, our institute um, uh, that has been also used to treat uh, children at our uh, sister institution. Uh, we decided to look at our adolescents and young adults treated our institution from uh, ages of 18 to 50 to look at the effect of BMI on their outcomes. And what we saw was that um, BMI uh, was a major factor in determining how well patients do after treatment. What we saw was that in patients with normal BMI, our younger and older patients had really excellent outcomes. Patients with a higher BMI uh, led to inferior outcomes, particularly in the older age group. And our patients who were in the older AYAs uh, with a higher BMI had a particularly poor outcome. And these are our patients that are most in need of new novel therapies uh, to improve their outcomes uh, when treated with pediatric-inspired regimens for ALL.